Mission completed, alien architecture. Wait, did he poop me out? You're alive? Ooh. I had a bet with a neighboring AI on YRG-43. It appears I have lost. Oh my gosh. While we were briefed out of contact, I received what I can only describe as a barrage of messages from our CEO concerning that object you have recovered. So I have marked your mission as complete. You can now return to the Javelin and begin the journey home if you wish, so long as it is sufficiently fueled. Oh yeah, it's got a full tank. That said, you are far from completing your survey of the planet. I understand if your recent experiences make you feel, uh, unclean. But I would remind you of significant bonuses if you complete your work before returning to Earth. Yeah, there's a few things we need to do. That last thing, it looks kind of like the mystery meat inside a dim sum. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> mystery meat and dim sum. Yeah, it seems like we did get eaten by the meatball guy and, well, he pooped us out right here at the beginning. So that was very good. We were able to get our uh, box back from whenever we died with all of our uh, loot inside of it, so that's good. And then, of course, I guess if we want to, we can continue on here because there were a few areas where it looked like I missed out on some stuff, so... Like, like am I able to just go back into there, or...? Because it was like an elevator that went down. I don't know if I'm able to come back up, or what, what do I have to do? Do I have to fight the boss again, or, or what? I don't know, but... Yeah, at least there's a convenient teleporter, like, right here at the beginning, and yeah, that is the last teleporter here in the landing site, so that's good. I guess we can see if there's anything else we haven't gotten, such as, you know, all the alien alloy. Might as well try and get all the upgrades, and like I said, try and get that DLC. I, I wonder how we're going to do that. Now, is that going to be- oh, wait, well, Vault Floor 4. Ugh, okay, so, Moist Vestibule. How do you even pronounce that? Vestibule? <laughs> I've never had to say that word before in my life. Vestibule. Yeah, Vestibule. Vestibule. A small entrance hall or passage between the outer door and the interior of a house or building. Uh, usually I call that just like a foyer, right? Or a foyer? How do you even pronounce that? What is the way to pronounce that? Foyer. Yeah, it is foyer. Hey, I was right in that regard. <laughs> but anyways, yeah. So we're here. We can go back to the Javelin Habitat. Yeah, so what is our current objective right now? Alien Tech uh, Journal. Yeah, this one right here. Oh yeah, Lost Cartography. We never did that. Golly. An automated alert on the cartographer has... So if I track that, does that actually show me what I need to do, where I need to go, etc.? I guess it does, I just- oh yeah, well it's taking me to the next teleport. Uh, but from there, I guess we can continue- and yeah, we got all the science experiments done. Still need to- wow, 90% on the Kindex, that's pretty good, alien edibles. Oh yeah, well at least this is pretty good here, it tells you like, what your progress is in each area. Landing site, we got all of them, that's great, 19, almost half of them in the itching fields. I hardly explore this area, we, we explored a lot of the landing site, explored a lot of the elevator realm, haven't explored that much of the itching fields, unfortunately. There's only two left in the elevator realm. That shouldn't be too hard to find. I suppose we could, uh, go to the elevator realm. I don't know. Where's that area that's kind of in the middle? Was it this? Tears of Tabo? I think it was this one. Pillars of Ex Exornia, whatever. I guess we could look around here and do that scan thing and see if it tells me where any orange goo may be lying around. Alien architecture, mission complete. Hey, yeah. We finally figured out what was in that tower, that meatball. <laughs> Yeah, okay, so it looks like there's an orange goo all the way down there, but how do we... I guess I have to ride these rails. And remember, we're at 18 out of 20, so we only need to get... Oh, wait, hold on, there's a, uh... Thing there, but how do I... Oh, jeez, I'm gonna fall. Ah, can I hook onto that? I can. Holy. And then we hook onto that. No, what in the world? <laughs> how are you supposed to hook onto that naturally? Wait, where did it take me? It took me all the way back here. Are you kidding me? <laughs> All right, yeah, let me write that again. All right, so we're here now. I guess I could have teleported there, but I feel like down here. Bye. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There you go. And I think this is where the orange goo was, wasn't it? Or is it like under? Wait, oh, I have to crouch. Yep, there it is right there. Okay, cool. So we got another orange goo. That's number eight, 19 out of 20 here. Or 78 out of 100 overall, so that's great there. And of course, we need to go back to the itching fields. Yeah, there's that one area in the itching fields we haven't even explored. That one with the uh, the eyeball creature. <laughs> I completely forgot about that, but are we able to write this? Whoa, there we go. <laughs> like, come on, launch me. Oh, I think it is. Holy heck. Launch me all the way over here. Woo. All right, so there's only one left here. Is he going to even show me? Oh, jeez. These guys. Is he even going to show me where the uh, last orange goo is? Oh, yeah. Wasn't there one... Hold on. I remember there was one like at the top of that third tower there and we ignored it. We're like, oh man, we'll get it whenever we actually go to that tower. Well, we finally went to the tower. Oh, and there's a secret. No, wait, hold on. Secret nearby. Is that a, uh, I bet it's a fuel thing. We already have full fuel and we don't even get a bonus. Wait, no, wait. Oh, it's one of these, uh, 
left notes or whatever. Yeah, explorer logs. What a strange story. These mission logs seem to have been written hundreds or perhaps thousands of years ago. I wonder whatever became of the poor Teratomo. Um. <laughs> we just saw what happened to Teratomo. You became the heckin' meatball at the bottom of the tower. <laughs> but anyway, speaking of towers and whatnot, let me keep going this way until we actually get to that. And then, yeah, yeah, right here. So if I just do this, I'm gonna be. Oh, I can see it. I can see the last orange goo. Oop. Yeah, yeah, you could easily miss because we're down there whenever we activated it, or where were we? But, uh, is this the last one here? I think so. Yep, 79 out of 100. Doesn't say how many we have here, but if I pull this up, 20 out of 20. Okay, cool. So now all we have left is just the itching fields. Then I guess, uh, survey the planet. Where would I keep track of that? Probably alien tech. Wow, one thing of alien tech we didn't get there. Holy heck, that's crazy. And then, uh, creatures, predator. Did we get all? Hold on. 19 out of 21. Two preys I haven't gotten. And then... Wait, hold on. How many was that? Yeah, two prey and two predator I haven't gotten. So four creatures. Oh, well, I would have said right there anyways. 37 out... Or 33 out of 37. And then there's flora. There's seven plants I haven't scanned. That's kind of crazy. Points... Kintech, I have uh, three I haven't scanned here. Points of interest. There's two... Wait, what? Alien effigy, crash meteor, repulsive tree, shattered pod, towering statue. Huh. I'm kind of surprised I, there's two there I haven't gotten. And there's two left here, which are the itching fields. Yeah, there's like two, like, secret areas or like areas in general, I guess you could say, in the uh, itching, which makes sense because, like I said, we haven't uh, explored that area too much. But within the spire, we got all those. Elevator realm got all those and got them all in the landing site. So that's good. We got those and then all the resources already got all those. Yeah. Orange goo, silicon, health essence. Oh, yeah, this one, the vitality plant. Uh, fuel, carbon, aluminum, alien alloy. Yeah, we got all those. So that's great there, but... Whoop! Oh, yeah, let's... Wait, can I... Oh! oh my... Hi. <laughs> Thank you for your service. I tried to slam. I I, I shouldn't take full damage. What happened? A poem. Do you want to hear it? Spaceman. Spaceman. Huh? Why do you keep dying? Spaceman. Do you like it? Poetry's not my strong suit. Yeah, well, I shouldn't have died there anyways. I think you were done. You killed that thing, but you're not. Well, you could be if you refueled the javelin. Kindred still has some glorious video rewards waiting if you completely and utterly finish your remaining tasks before going home. Oh, wait. Hey, MOBA, 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 VR 17, whatever. <laughs> But yeah, we have it fully, fully fueled, so we'll have to worry about that, but I guess we have to go back there and grab my heckin' stuff from where I died. Yeah, this place landing. Yeah, so I have no fall damage, but I slammed, I guess I slammed a little bit too hard. 112 degrees, bioscience, phenomenal. Yeah, let's go get our stuff, because we had like carbon and whatnot on me, right? So let's just go get it back, and I guess we'll go back to the itching fields, because there's a few places there we haven't even discovered, and I'm sure a few uh, plants and animals that we might not have discovered too. And of course, a lot of orange goo, and maybe even some alien alloy. Oh, here it is right here. Okay, let's grab it. What do we have? Uh, oh, not too bad. A little bit of silicon, a little bit of aluminum, and uh, 158 carbon. So I'm glad I got it back because we need that for crafting those final upgrades. That and the alien alloys. That's the thing that's holding me back. All right, I'm back on the ship. I want to use the computer because we just got that note, and I want to see what it says because I, I think, didn't Echo, Eco, whatever her name is, say something about this guy named, like, Teratomo, and that's that was the name of the meatball guy that we just defeated. Where's that going to be? Messages, alien re... Oh, yeah, yeah, it's going to be here. It's got the exclamation point right there, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah right there. Oh, wait, no, that's transmission frag. That's one of the video things, yeah. Uh, we, yeah, we found one while in the... Whatever that was called right there, right? Like the meatballs layer or whatever. So transmission fragment number nine. If anything, this is going to be good here. It's going to be nine and then 10. So let's actually watch nine first and then see how it connects to 10. So it's kind of like a video of like the world and something surrounding it. And then what happens? Whoa! The planet just like explodes with ancient alien language saying something. Let's read about expedition log number four. See what this is about. Rangor. Oh, yeah, Rangor Teratomo. Wait, hold on. Teratomo. So this, the guy that was exploring became the meatball. That's why. Wait, I want to make sure. Let me check my footage. That guy was named Teratomo, wasn't he? Whenever I was battling him. Was it this one? Hold on. Yeah, he was named Teratomo during the boss battle. So that was him. Huh? Okay, well, good news and bad news. Let's see what he says here. 
Rancor Teratomo, Chief Explorer of the Zoxaloid Space Initiative. The good news, I continue to make terrific progress toward reaching the top of the tower. I seem to have found myself an entirely new biome full of towering mushrooms and other fungus-based organisms. It's amazing that such biodiversity exists on this same planet. I wonder if the tower has anything to do with it. The not-so-good news, I'm not really feeling super great. My stomach is starting to feel a bit bloated, and a reasonable amount of nausea has begun to set in. I've had a little more trouble making forward progress, but if I take periodic rests, I should be fine. A few potential explanations come to mind. It could be a sort of post-cryo hangover. It could be altitude sickness from my tower climb. It could be the two years expired can of Zoxaletti I ate after landing. I mean, yeah, it was covered in mold, but it was green mold, and green mold is the good mold, right? It could also be that I'm wearing no helmet and breathing untested air, but I doubt it. Uh, Teratomo, out. Okay, so yeah, that's the one that we got at the top of the elevated realm or something like that. Deposit the planet seed into the javelin sucker tube. What? Okay, I guess we'll do that because we still have the planet seed in my inventory, right? Where do I do that? Where do I physically implant the planet's seed? <laughs> is it this? Oh, here it is. Yeah, 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 right there. Awesome. Okay, so now I'm going to deposit the planet seed into the sucker tube. And I guess she's going to analyze it and tell me about it. And there you go. Investigate the tower mission complete after 12, 13 episodes. Is she going to say something about it or do I have to wait until the mini mall monkey's ad is over? <laughs> I don't know. Is there anything new that I got from that, though? Oh, yeah, we can get the shark fruit booster and whatnot. We only have one alien alloy, though, and I kind of want to go to the, uh, whatever that other area was, the itching field. Uh, explore that area, because there was a lot that we kind of skipped out on over there, unfortunately. Advanced stomp booster, stomp wider and stomp harder. Yeah, maybe if I had that, I wouldn't have died a minute ago, right? <laughs> Falling from that huge height. Yeah, I bet that's what I need that for, but I don't know if I'm going to get it just yet. I don't know if I want to spend that last alien alloy on that, right? Yeah, I don't know. Uh, let's just go explore the itching fields real quick. Uh, I don't know if we have any other missions that we need to... Oh yeah, other than Lost Cartographer. Which, by the way, is that in here? Where do, where do I have to do this? Let's go to the Itching Fields. Oh, it is in the Itching Fields. Huh. Fungi of Cyanid. I guess we'll go here and kind of two birds with one stone, huh? Planetary Flossum. Yeah, there's this area here towards the bottom. We might as well, yeah, start from the bottom and start working our way up. Because I know there's a whole lot of areas that we just skipped out on over here. And yeah, that reminds me, uh, for a while now... You guys remember that first area where we're like, oh, you need to have the ability to like ride on rails to continue on here. I never went back there ever since we got the ability to ride on the rails. I need to go over there. That's probably going to be another area that they're like, yeah, eh, you need to explore this. There's probably like new critters and, and uh, stuff over there. But I do know over here there was this area that we kind of skipped out on. Ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> it sounds like a ghost. But uh, but there's a lot of yeah, orange goo there. Orange you there, alien alloy there. I th yeah, I bet that alien alloy opens up whenever we poke that guy in the eye, huh? So if I do this, hang over here, and try to sneak up on him. And yeah, we get these fish guys here. And there he is right there. Now he's right there. Spinning around. I don't think, yeah, he can't see me from this angle, so I might be able to just launch myself up by doing this. And then, whoop, and then just poke him in the eye. There we go, man, that was close. <laughs> there you go, vault more open. Now the alien island, actually, while wow, we're here in this advantageous position, in the orange uh, glue, any orange uh, glue, yep, right there, hidden. And I think we have only like 20 left here, right? Yeah, yeah, 80 out of 100, because we got them in all the other locations. So we just need to get 20 more in this one singular area, which is insane, but 25 out of 32 of the alien alloys just in general, so we still need to get seven more, and I bet a bunch of them are here in the itching fields. I do see this rail over here, though. Where's this taking? Is this an alien alloy or a... Uh... Probably a fuel thing that I don't need or anything like that, right? Let's see. Oh, it's an orange goo. Okay, I'll take that. Boom. So we just need 19 more. Wait, didn't we need 21 more before I got that one right there? So this, <laughs> there's that magical number again. Seems like, yeah, the next area is to go there and then alien alloy there. And then, yeah, just keep climbing up, it seems like. So I guess I didn't really miss out on too much over here. Definitely want to grab more of these resources like aluminum, silicon, etc. Uh, just in case I need them for crafting other things. You know, just so we can actually craft everything before we end off. Yeah, I need to go all the way over there to get that orange goo. Is there anything I have to latch onto, or how do I get up there normally? Because I don't see... I don't see a way to get up. Oh, wait, hold on. I see it. There's a rail I need to ride there, and then we land there. But how do I get there? All right, I'm up here now. So where do I need to go from this? So it looks like there, but there's this area all the way down there. And yeah, there's this whole area over here. We never even went this direction. Look at this. Hold on. What the heck is that thing over there? Is that one of the things I haven't scanned? Yeah, it is. Wow. A buzzing nest. Be 
Maybe stick your face in. Let's <laughs> see what happens. No, I'm not doing that, Echo. Eco, whatever your name is, I don't know. Oh, these guys have a uh, amber on their heads. Yeah, there's like a whole tree over here. It's like toppled over or something. The heck? Look at all this. I've had the, yep, the infested husk. Yep, a whole new air. Oh, wait, hold on. Get swarms. Oh, jeez. What in the world? This whole entire time we have this whole area that we just ignored. <laughs> Crazy. What do we do here? Oh, yeah. Well, there's barnacles right here. So, uh, actually, yeah, I could probably just whoop, and then just launch myself up to there, right? And then, whoop. yeah, hold on. Let me scan this guy. Can I scan him? Wait, yeah, we already have him scanned. Yeah. So, are they even doing anything? They're just looking at me and then just forgetting about me. So, I, I feel like I could just ignore them, honestly. Let's go have this some more. Whoop. And then, oh, wow, there's already a spot right there. Okay. But does this take me to the, uh, to the rail bit? I don't know. Yeah, another guy right here. Another one right there. Another one right there. Where does this go? Yeah, I don't know. This is, uh, hopefully no one's afraid of heights, you guys. Golly. But if I scan here... Yeah, it's still all the way down. I guess technically... Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, my gosh. I guess technically from here, I could just fall all the way down there, and that takes me to, uh, orange goo, but I wonder if I can keep going higher. Yeah, it looks like starting a staircase right here, honestly. Yeah. Yeah, okay, well... And then, yo, yep, we got barnacles there, but I might be able to just skip, honestly. <laughs> skip to there. Why am I, why am I shooting literal bugs? I can just swam away. Blip. Then there you go. And I guess from here to there. Oh, wow. Oh, whoa. Hold on. We got a Voltivore, but it, yeah, it just opens up. Okay. I'll grab it though. Blip. There you go. Anything else up here, by the way? Oh, yeah. Another one right there. 30 meters away. 30 meters away. Inventory full of uh, blight bombs. Down there is even more stuff. Golly, that's what I'm talking about. We missed out on so much over here in the itching fields. Doesn't seem like there's anything on the outer rim of this, this tree trunk. Actually, hold on. Isn't there an orange goo or... Yeah, well, there's blight bombs right here. Or uh, amber that I need to throw blight bombs at. That's why they had blight bomb plants just a minute ago, but I bet some sort of enemy. Whoops. At least it's going to be charged up, but there's an orange goo. Oh! Well, that obviously bounced off because he didn't have a blight bomb uh, hit him yet, but there you go. <laughs> Now I got those buffer birds. Cool. Man, I miss doing the uh, science experiments. I wish we still had some science experiments like could do. Just because that was pretty fun. But 82 out of 100. Need to get 18 more of those. Golly. So, going over this edge. And I'm eventually going to just land and no damage. Jeez, I fell even harder right there. But now there's the rail. And then... Isn't there an orange gear that's supposed to be here? Hold on. Wait, what? Or did I miss it? Or am I, like, really... <laughs> I don't know, but there's orange gear right there. Oh, it's like right below me, though. Hold on. But where's this go? Uh, yeah, it's like right there. So, uh, whoop, land right next to this fish guy. Hey, how's it going? How you doing? Uh, tortoise shell skipper. <laughs> Gonna grab that orange goo, though. Looks like the eyeball guy respawned back there, unfortunately. So, how in the world do you even get up here normally? Well, this guy's just kind of hanging out. I feel like he's a piece of the puzzle on how you get here. I'm like, I'll, I'll try and like rail up to. Oh, wow, this actually what? It actually worked. How in the heck? And it's taking me to another orange goo. Jeez. And of course, more carbon, more uh, what looks like aluminum. Probably metallic sea bags above me. Oh, yeah, a little bit of everything there. Even add some silicon, too. Golly, that's great. All right, I'm back up here from the, the barnacles and whatnot. Ooh, barely hit that edge right there. So where do I go for the... Yeah, Lost Cartographer's like right there. Where in the world is it? Hey, more uh, aluminum right there. I'll grab that. See how to get over there, though. Like, do I, if I continue here, do I eventually get over there? I don't know. I feel like I'm going a roundabout way of getting over there, honestly, but... If I get there in the... Oh, here we go. Domain of the Untamed Beast. What? Hold on. Let's just sneak into there in this way that we're obviously not supposed to get into. Whoa! Wait, hold on. Hold on. Yeah, I already... There it is. Serving as lunch. Yeah, I already fought this thing, didn't I? Yeah, Capienna. Yeah, so I guess if anything, we should have fought the, the Capienna a little bit earlier during the uh, itching fields. We would have fought it now instead of during the elevator realm, right? I can hit him right here, though. There you go. Hit him in the tail. Oh, oh it's going to come over here. If it misses. Oh, well, yeah, it's teleporting her. You know, it's moving so fast. It looks like it's teleporting. But boom, there you go. We got it. Was there another one? Yep. I think another one's coming. Does this going to be the male? Oh, wait. No, it's two of them at the same time. Okay. Actually, yeah. Can't I just... The bomb grants. Oh man, I have like no bomb grants, so this is kind of bad. <laughs> it's actually really bad. Yeah, I'm missing. Yeah, they're... neither of them got hit right there, unfortunately. Golly. Oh, there we go. I got one of them. Or at least, you know, one of their tails. <laughs> one of the four targets. Their tails like behind. Oh, there you go. Another hit, I think. Man. Oh, and we got another secret nearby, but I'm getting absolutely mauled over here, unfortunately. But there you go. That one's down. And we got one more tail, right? Ah, oh, golly. At least I 
shoot a bunch until I have to reload. Yeah, 15. Yeah, there we go. We got him. Is there going to be another one? Is this the mail? Now go fix my stuff. Oh, okay. I guess I have to go take care of whatever you're uh, doing. Collect the data from the cartographer. So I guess, yeah, this is the part of the lost cartographer thing then, huh? Where, where is the cartographer? I didn't even see him. Oh, it crashed landed like right there. I didn't even notice him. <laughs> That's cool. So let's pick him up. There you go. Looks like your antenna stuck in the bones or something like that, but there you go. Hey, I rescued him. I found another source of alien alloy, marking it on your compass. So that was all that was? You know, in the back of my head, I was thinking, oh, is this lost cartographer? Or is that is that the thing that introduces me into the DLC? But no, it literally is just a cartographer that's like crashing into the ground and stuck in like a bone or something like that. But it seems like there's a secret nearby. I don't know if it's talking about alien alloy or whatever over there, but I kind of, oh, this might be it. Hold on. Found this. Is this going to take me? Wait, where is this? Okay, so it looks like, okay, th this looks like it might take me to that other orange goo, which is good. And I don't think, yeah, we were unable to stop that until we get to the next area, the alien, or the uh, elevated realm. So that's good that we got that and we come back now. So we could actually go grab that other orange goo and whatnot, but yeah, look at that. There's another barnacle thing I need to grapple hook, uh, grapple seat onto and whatnot over there. It's crazy, but let's keep looking around. Oh, wow, even more right there. If we could find any blight bombs, because I have none right now, and I need to go explode something over there. Yeah, I like crash landed like right there when it was scouting around the area. And even I got stuck right there. That's crazy. But now this area's opened up. Let's go over to the bomb granite. Or just mid blight a bomb. 13, 12, 13, 14 episodes in. I'm still messing it up. But there you go. There's orange goo behind this or what? Yeah, that's what I thought. And it gave me the aluminum and whatnot. Call it the wrong thing. It's literally called silicon. It's on the screen. <laughs> I need to get 15 more, uh, 14 more after we go to that area we just stomped at a minute ago. And now uh, alien alloy is available. And we have how many? 20 something out of 32, I think. We have three on me right now, so I might want to go home and craft something. Yeah, we just need to get five more, and they're all, I think, in this area, right? Uh, yeah, they're all here. Just four more here in the ancient fields. Oh, wait, no, yeah, there's one on the landing side. I wonder where that is. 10 out of 11 on the landing side. It's got to be really, really hidden there, I bet, right? Or it may be inside of one of the osmotic cubes, perhaps. There is another secret, apparently, nearby, and I don't know what it's talking about. Is it talking about this or, or what? And by the way, holy heck, alien alloy there, alien alloy there. Scan again. I bet you find another one, but yeah, it looks like down here might take me to that random floating island that has another uh, orange goo. Yeah, it looks like it. Yet, yeah. if I go here, where do I go from here? I guess I'll try it. Or is that a ra It is a rail. What in the world? Where does this go, though? It just kind of spins around, and I need to, yeah, I need to jump here. And this goes, oh, to another area I need to stomp. Yeah, thankfully, I have that stomp ability. This takes me to. Oh, another note! Huh! Wait, what? Slap it! I need to scan it! There you go, another explorer's log. So where are they gonna be in the storyline? Because obviously I missed that and I wasn't able to get it until now that we have the stomp and whatnot. Is that the secret that they're talking about though? If I go back to where I was a minute ago, is that gonna tell me, oh, no more secret nearby or whatever? I don't know why these hooks are even here. I could just jump here. If I, if I need that stomp ability, I'm obviously late game enough to double jump, maybe even quadruple jump, uh, triple jump, etc. right? But. Let's get on out of here. Blip. Is it still going to tell me about the seeker? Or how I got that? It's going to be like, oh, you already got it. So don't worry about it. I feel like that was it. Yeah. It's not telling me about it anymore. So if I want to go over that island that we just saw a minute ago, do I need to go like here and then go back? Or... Yeah, right here. And it seems like this is the way to go. Let's see. Hold on. Let's do this. No more secrets. And by the way, yeah, right there. Oh, wow. There's orange goo like right there. I guess I get that on the way back, but is there anything else? Another one on the tree. There is another. Wait, what? There's one on that tree over there that I missed out on. Didn't I scan and went on over there? Guess I didn't. Huh. Well, anyways, let's try and uh, go onto this rail. Blip. Let's go get this orange goo and a uh, little bit of silicon right there and whatever that is right there. Grapple seed. Yeah, we are. Right. Tons of that. This is 86 out of 100. Just need to get 14 more. But there's one all the way. I don't think I'm able to make it over there. Yeah, you know what? Let's go, let's, let's ride back on this. Let's go get that orange goo at the top of that mushroom over there. And I guess we'll go back to that. What is it called? Infested husk or whatever it's called. Actually, yeah, there's, yep, another one over there too. Yeah, it's all in the distance. And we need grapple seeds for it too. So thankfully we're full on that now. But how do we get to the top of that? Yeah, maybe grapple seed up to there. And then, actually, yeah, I think I can go from here. Yeah, let's wait for that to charge back up. Then, whoop, now we're on top of these mushrooms. Cool. And I think from here, can't I just, whoop. And then I can make it all the way over to the... Yep. Now we have a grapple point over there. Okay, cool. So now let's go grab this orange cube. Boom. Let's go grab this one real quick. Oh. Some sort of... What is that? 
Oh, I see another, yep, I see a Voltivore over there, and it looks like a Tendril right there. Boom, got it. Tendril there. Can I shoot it from here? I'm too far away. I'm, I'm hitting it on my end, but it's not registering. I guess I'm a little bit too far for the game to really be like, yeah, he's got that good of aim. <laughs> We're not even going to accept that fact. And I'm not bragging, but there he goes. 87 out of 100, and we're going to get 88 over here in just a minute, too. So that's going to be great. I don't even need to get that one, do I? I'll, I'll try and, uh, I say, I'll, hold on. He's a little bit far away, but I can launch here. Oh, my gosh! <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's just grapple seat on that. And then we'll, uh, blip. There you go. And then, oh, yeah, obviously. Okay, yeah, we need to go there and then there. Yeah, well, I'm trying to skip too many steps over here, you guys. It's crazy. There you go. And then that one. Yeah, we got plenty of grapple seats. So I don't know why I'm, like, trying to conserve all my grapple seats. But there you go. Oh, bomb grant. So I threw... Do a bomb grant here. I need to run away so I don't have to kill myself. So, whoop, go over here. Now it's safe to go inside and grab that orange goo, right? That's going to be 88, I think. Let's grab this aluminum, nice. And yep, 88. Did I just say nose? Nice, nice. I don't even know what I'm saying. I don't even know how to speak the English language, but go up here. Doesn't seem like there's anything else. So that's good. But yeah, I see an alien, uh, alloy, alien alloy of Ultivore over there. As well as we still need to go to that ancient Husker, uh, Whatever that's called, but there's another thing all the way down there, too, so... Golly, we're missing out on a ton here in the itching fields, but I'm glad I came back here. Because as you can see, we're making some great progress in a pretty short amount of time on us. Oh, jeez! Well, thankfully, I don't have to worry about full damage, so... I'm good in that regard. Can I shoot this now, or is it going to... Oh, yeah, there you go. We got it. Cool. But I'm getting shot by all these, like, little bugs, though. Where in the world is this one at? He's over here. I see him. I see him. Boom! Got him both with... I don't know how I got him right there. I don't know if there's any auto-aim already built into the game to... Gotta make it feel like I have better aim than I actually do, but there you go, getting all these tongue guys. Oh, there we go. Yeah, so that's open now, but how do I get up there to get the, the alien alloy itself? Or hold on, hold on. Now I need to go on these mushroom caps. A little bit of silicon and aluminum. Or call it the wrong thing again. Carbon and silicon over here. Just grab it. It's like in colorblind or something like that. There you go, grab those. And I wonder how much we actually have. I might want to go back to the javelin just to drop off our stuff. Where's this critter at? Seems like there's some sort of bugs phasing in and out of reality and whatnot. Oh, wait, hold on. There's a tomato plant or something like that over here, as well as a secret nearby. And I wonder if that secret is referring to where I'm going right now to get the alien alloy. So if I go here, tomato plant right here, make sure we get... Actually, let's go right now. There we go. This is how we get up to there. Just go up to this, and then... Secret nearby, yeah. Are there any other secrets here? I don't think so. I think it's talking about exclusively that, unless there's something over here. Maybe. I don't, I don't see it, though. How in the world do you get up there? <laughs> I don't think this is the way you're supposed to go, honestly. Once we get up there, I bet I'm going to discover... Oh, whoops! I should have gone this way, because it's the more natural way that I should have gone. Because <laughs> I'm always going the long, roundabout way to get to places, right? Golly. Whoop! Oh, and now we're up here. Okay. Yeah, so from... Oh, yeah, look at that. There's a grapple point right there. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this whole time, I didn't even need to come up here doing the staircases and jumps and all the kind of stuff. Boom, slap that alien alloy and I have to go chase after it now. <laughs> but there you go. You got another orange goo all the way down there. It seems like I missed out on another one down here. Wait, did I get that one? That one seems kind of familiar. Hold on. Yeah, because I remember there's a cave here. 32 meters. Yeah, there's a cave right here. Oh, wait, no, I got that. Wait, wait, where's this one at then? 22. Oh, I need to fall another layer. Oh, then, oh, yep. Yeah. Orange goo right there. I just need to... I just don't know where I'm going to go with this pomegranate, so you know what? Uh, whoop. Ah, no! My God! Wow, that actually worked. I thought I was going to have to come all the way back around, but I was able to quadruple and jump my way back here. Golly. Let's get that. What's that, 89? Yep. Man, we just need to get 11 more. There you guys. And now that we're in this lower area, which I completely skipped out on a ton, too, I know, yeah, there's a alien alloy over there. I can see a bomb grant thing I can go interact with as well over there, and there's some mushroom things I can... I mean, I thought I could hook on to something right there, but I guess not. There's so much I haven't discovered here, you guys. Even some silicon right there, and I can see... Looks like a tendril, yep. So there's the Voltivore. Where are all these tendrils I need to... And I need to get a little bit of health right there. <laughs> I'm getting tongued by these guys again. That probably sounds completely disgusting, by the way. I need to come up with different words to describe that, but... The worlds are a point right here for me. To, like, I'm not complaining. I'll grab it, though. Let's grab some of the silicon while we're at it, too. Oh, another uh, tendril right there. It's only two out of three. Oh, and I bet the third is behind that, right? Wait, did I pop it, too? I guess so. I guess I'll grab the alien alloy before a heckin' tongue guy steals it from me. <laughs> Where'd he go? 
He's either above or below me. I can't tell, but it's going to. Oh, oh there's like music's like acting up over here, but whatever was over here is completely destroyed. So I guess there was a tendril over here. I just don't know where it's at now. So that's kind of crazy. But there's another. Oh, oh, it's a bat guy. Hold on. Where'd he go? He's underneath something. I don't know where he's at, but he's like boomeranging around. Oh, yep, yeah, right there. Oh, man, there he is right there. Yeah, I can't shoot him whenever he's still, but there you go. Whenever he launches out, then he's vulnerable. There you go. Grab that. Anything else around here, though? In the near vicinity? Man, there's a 132, 128, and then a 77. Yeah, there's that rail area. Golly, there's so much around here, guys. So much around here that I'm missing out on. It's insane. And yeah, there's a whole area. Yep. You see, uh, and then another. Man, there's so much orange goo just in this one little condensed area, guys. It's crazy. I'm surprised that we didn't see this all on the way over here. Like, I just ignored everything and made it to the heckin' elevator realm, and I just ignored all this, but... Let's go grab this one that's over here. Let's go ride this rail, too, it looks like, but... Oh, no, I knew it! I knew it! I'm trying to skip too many steps. <laughs> I'm too anxious to get the other one to go. Thankfully, I don't count as a death, but, uh... Wait, this isn't even... Yeah, we need to keep elevating up, and then we ride the rails. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then... Yeah, another spot right here, and then we ride the rails. Yeah, I'm always just trying to cut in line over here. <laughs> You don't want to take me to an amusement park, you guys. But here we go. Oh, man, I should have threw the bomb grand. I'm going to get blown up when I ride through that. So, uh, unless... Lip. And then we rail ourselves back. Hold on. Wait, what? Wait, what? Oh, I have to do it. Oh, man. thought maybe I could jump back, but nope. Now, at least we're safe. Even though I'm not in full health or anything like that, so it didn't even matter. But hey, I'm going to get this orange goo. Let's go to be number 90, I think. Or... Yep, nope, 91. Man, so we still have this one that's, like, right there. Yeah, that one pff, just wasted a bomb grenade right there, but thankfully we have enough bomb grenades two ways. It doesn't even matter. I see another orange goo all the way over there. Let's go over here. Yeah, orange goo there, and I saw another one at the top of the thing over there, top of the tree over there. Of course, we wanted to hustle. Let's go to be one, two, three, four. We're at 91 right now. It's going to take us to 95. Holy heck. Whoop. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Okay. All right, so we got 92 out of 100. Man. And there you go. Get a little bit of aluminum for my trouble, too. Let's go grab that orange goo that's at the top of that, and yeah, we need to watch out for these that are going to just fall down. Make sure we have some double jumps lined up. Okay, we are good. So we're going to start falling down too, but... Whoop. And let's grab this one. Anything else up here, though, by the way? You can see in the background there is another orange goo that I'm going to head towards here in just a bit. That's going to be number 94. Another one all the way up there. Let's grab this. Oh, wow, there's like a thing over there, too. I wonder if I could actually go over there, but... I'll launch myself up this? Oh, wow, whoa! Am I not able to get this yet? Or do I need to go all the way up there and then just fall down? Wow, I was able to do that though. That was crazy. But there we go, 94 or 5? Yeah, 4. God, lay! There's another bomb again. Can I throw it from here? I don't know if I can. I'll try. All the way over there. Yeah, I missed. I need to give it some time so it explodes. I get it? It oh my gosh, it actually worked. What? I'm gonna get it from here. I don't know if I can. Ooh. Ooh, then I'm gonna miss it again! No, there's an orange goo there! How'd I get to the... Oh, I see it. Okay, yeah, that's obvious. <laughs> oh, he's trying to cut in lines and make it a little bit easier than it needs to be, but I think over here... Yeah, over here we got a, uh... This is the thing I was trying to ride that one time, and I was unable to because I didn't have the... Oh, shit! <laughs> Golly! Yeah, here we go. What in the... Oh, it's just... It's just free orange goo, okay. I thought, I thought maybe it was like another gauntlet and I had to like watch out for lasers and whatnot, but no, that was all I had to do there. So 95, 96 if I grab that one there and then a 97th on that, uh, wait, what in the world, where is this? I don't know where the, where the heck to go, but, oh, there it is. Yeah, I, I know you need to get the laser or the light thing there, but I'm just ignoring it. I'm in a rush, you guys know me, I need, I need to hurry up. I need to cut in line to ride the roller coaster. Oh, we got a secret nearby again. Wait, what? Is there this? Oh my gosh, it's more fuel. Oh my gosh, how did I see that? Yeah, extract that, but I don't need that. I already have a full javelin. Let's see. So there's one on the roof I had to ride, right? Yeah, all the way over there. Can I reach it from here? Oh, I'm, this might not be the legitimate way to do it, but it's taking me over there anyways. Boom. Orange goo. Slap it out of the way and put that in my mouth. Slurping it up. Now we just need to get three more besides the one that's inside the infected tree, so. Seems like they're a hundred, but wait, where is that? Where could that possibly be? Where could that be? Oh my gosh. I didn't even notice this. 
Holy hell. Yeah, see, we would not, we would have missed out on so much. And we did miss out on so much of this orange goo by not having that HUD upgrade. What in the world is that? 64 minutes. Wait, where is that? It's really close, but I don't want to go over to that tree because I know I'm going to forget about it. By the way, where's that other orange goo that was like supposedly in this area? Because I know I'm going to forget about that one too. Oh, there it is. 136 meters that way. See if I can get to that real quick. It seems like it might be below us, so I might be able to just go down there, fall down there real quick. 60 something meters this way. Oh, and it takes me towards that alien alloy, too. Yeah, we never went that direction. Golly, and this one's really at least hidden in the weeds, and I might as well get some more bomb grants while I'm at it, right? Blah, 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 because I just used up a bunch of them. Let's see, it's in the weeds here, right? Yep, there you go. Orange goo. That's 97, 98. Man, 99's on that tree. We just need to figure out where these the last one's at. Come on, come on. Oh, we get jelly off there, but I think you can just ignore him for right now, right? Yeah, I keep heading this way, and I'm getting close to this alien alloy. Is this one just out in the open, or do I have to do something? Yeah, oh, yeah, I have to defend something. What is it? Oh, jelly Waff? Nope, he's dead. I'm hearing the horns of war. I just have to fend off this. Yeah, I, th I, think, I think we just have to... Oh, no, 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 don't shoot him whenever he's spinning like that. Boom, there you go. Yeah, just have to survive all the jelly wasps. Boom, 30 out of 32. I think that means there's only one left here in the itching fields, and of course that one random one that's left in the, the landing site area, right? Yeah. We're making some really good progress today, guys. Oh, is this, ooh, right here with a falling tomato. Ooh, yeah. I completely missed out on this. Is there something? Oh, it's an alien, uh, what is it, tablet? Yeah, enigmatic tablet. Fascinating. The video begins to take shape. It appears to describe the function of the tower itself. Well, I'm like, we already know about that, so I don't know how helpful that's going to be right now, but hey, at least we get a little bit of uh, bloop, silicon and uh, aluminum right there. Anything else around here? At least we're finding all these secrets and whatnot, right? So that's good. Oh, wow, looks like, yeah, the last alien alloy that's here, and then, of course, the final one, like, straight up in the game, is on the uh, landing site. But the last one here in the itching fields is all the way down there, but I don't know how to get to there. While I'm up here, though, let's go grab the last orange goo that's in that husk tree whatever it's called over there. It seems like it's hidden in that down area down there. Is there a secret around here? Oh my god, it's, uh, it's talking about it. Is it hidden back? Oh my gosh. I knew it. All the way back here. Let's see. Loop. Smash it. What in the world? That was a glitch and a half. Loop. Another. Oh, it's another fuel. I don't need that. I guess I'll tell the uh, whatever's grab it anyways. Yeah, we have a bunch. We have enough fuel to Go back to Earth and then come back, I guess, huh? Well, then again, if we're at Earth, we just get fueled anyways, because we're already there, but you guys know what I mean. <laughs> More of these bug guys here. Wow, he headed, like, straight towards me and I can die. Oh, wait, no, that... Huh, it's all the way over there. Yeah, I was completely distracted by this area here, you guys. Didn't I scan, like, on the outskirts and I still didn't... Yo, what in the world? How'd I miss that? <laughs> That's crazy. Okay, let's go grab it real quick. And this is going to be the last one in the game, or? No, 99 out of 100. Yeah, where's this last one at? I don't know. Let's just go down here and try and figure out how we get that last alien alloy. We got 34. Where is this? Oh my gosh, I bet it's this. Hold on. It looks like it is. I think we got the last alien alloy. Oh, it's in one of these guys, though. One of these osmotic cube guys. Huh. All right, well, kick him out of here. <laughs> Slap him, kick him out of here. Uh, I don't know. There's a lot of metallic seed bags down there. I know I got comments to be guys saying, yeah, you, you could also uh, break open ores and whatnot. But the ores are, I, I think they're limited. They don't respawn back in. So it makes sense to just spawn in metallic seed bags on top of them. So those respawn back in after like 10, 20, 30 seconds or whatever, right? But if I get this guy. Yeah, right here. Boom, metallic seed bag right there. Well, I'm soaking up some of them, unfortunately, so... I don't know, maybe I'll just keep them, like, right there, specifically. Wait for that metallic seed bag to keep respawning back in over and over and over again. Man, he's absolutely huge right now. Oh, no, the metallic seed bag, is he going to... Did he eat all those? Oh, I guess he did. I don't know if he can actually... Oh, wow, he actually eats the grapple seeds when I would just throw them. Huh. Okay, well, eat those. Keep eating them. Give me that metallic... Oh, he's, oh, he's exploding now! Yeah, I guess I could have just kept throwing grapple seeds at him, but boom! Let's grab that, and then... We have 31 out of 32, you guys. Oh my gosh, and we got a bunch of aluminum right there, too. That's crazy good. Oh yeah, like I said a minute ago, let me keep going around the itching fields here and try and get that last orange goo, figure out where that is. Oh my gosh, our last orange goo is in that area over there where we first saw the prime jelly wafts. Which makes sense, because yeah, all the way back there, we did not have this HUD upgrade, so could have easily missed it, and we did, like I said, so 
Just hook all the way up here, and this is going to be 100 out of 100. I wonder what happens then. Does anything special happen, or is it just going to be a little celebration back at the javelin where it's like, hey, congratulations, and then a bunch of confetti falls, and that's basically it. <laughs> kind of like whenever I level up, right? So let's take down this guy before you. Oh, there you go. Got him before he started spinning. That's good. But where? Where's his last shell? Oh. Oh my gosh, of course it's behind a bunch of grass. Golly, but there you go. 100 out of 100, and I got an achievement. Alien edibles. Detecting no remaining goo on the surface of the planet. You got every last bit. Even though your body is now 95% tumor, I've got to say, you've never looked better. I didn't expect you to make it this far, but I'm happy to be proven wrong. Really rooting for you to get out of this in one piece. One big tumor filled piece. <laughs> One big tumor filled piece. Yeah, at least I'm still 5% human, right? Jeez. Uh, even after all these clones and copies and blah, 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 right? But anyways, let's go back to the javelin. I guess we'll go back to that one landing zone, try and find that last alien alloy, and that's going to be it. We're going to be 100%ing the game, I think, right? Or what? And maybe after that, we'll finally be able to move on to the DLC. I don't know how to actually activate that. Or if I even own it, I don't even know. I probably didn't even buy it. I, I probably need to still buy it or something like that. I bet that's something I still haven't done. All right, let's go back to the javelin habitat. Ah! And then, of course, we need to go to the landing zone and start skiing around there for that last alien alloy. If you want Seven it. alien alloys in my inventory, almost a thousand silicon. I might as well get those second upgrades right now. <laughs> yeah, let's see. Alien art. Hey, you know what? Yeah, let's get the alien artifact detector just so I could find wherever all these other ones are, right? Upgrade complete. Boom. Alien artifact detector, fuel detector. I don't even need that, but maybe that'll help out with any secrets I come across. Faster refuel, advanced stop boosters. Yeah, sure. You know what? Let's get that. Upgrade complete. All right, nice. I guess I'll just get every upgrade if I can, because I almost have all the alien alloys anyways, right? Advanced battery, sure. 400 silicon. Upgrade synthesized. Man. But we have 2,000 aluminum still. Golly. Improved damage, sure. I already have the, the boss completely defeated and everything like that, but hey, nothing's stopping me from getting all these upgrades. Another shock fruit stable, or shock fruit booster, sure. Upgrade synthesized. I assume that means I could use shock fruit from even further distance than I can already, right? And the backpack, that's the faster refuel, and then the visor, that's the fuel detector. Uh, I only have one alien alloy left, but we're going to go get the last one here in just a bit anyways, but for this last uh, upgrade, what do we want to do? Uh, faster refuel? Sure, I don't care. <laughs> I thought that means for the uh, the boost, like recharge or whatever, right? So the last upgrade is just the heckin' fuel detector, which we don't even need. Uh, but we still need to get that last alien alloy, which we might as well go find right now. It's down there. 122. Wait, is that another cube guy or? What is that? 120. Wait, yeah, wasn't this? It was like hidden. It was like beneath, but I never figure out how to get to it, right? The 25 minutes. How do I get down to there? I need to figure out how to get down there. Yeah, it's right there, 47 meters there, 44 meters. Let me look closely around here, see if there's any, like, cubbies you need to, like, crawl through or anything like that, because I don't know how to get into this area. Oh my gosh, you guys, I think I found it. Oh, jellyfish guy, got him. Yeah, I think I found it. I think it's behind this waterfall. It's kind of obvious now, like, going around here, trying to look at these entrances and whatnot, but if I just jump into there, is there actually going to be anything there? Oh my gosh! Never mind! Never mind! <laughs> Man, okay, save me your die. Oh. Did your best. Oh, wait. It wasn't very good, but it was your best. I actually died there. Oh, how was nothingness? I thought the cartographer was gonna save me. Did he not save me? I even saved one of the cartographers. Man! Moba 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 game. Alright, so how do I get back there again? Dowering crystals, I think, yeah. All right, well, I guess I get my stuff. At least I dropped off like 90% of the heckin' loot, right? Oh. Yeah, I, th I think whatever's inside of that little bag over there, I think I think it's just going to be like stuff I got from the jelly wasp whenever I killed them, right? So that shouldn't be too bad, but uh, yeah, carbon and silicon and whatnot. But other than that, oh, another. is there an entrance that's down? Wait. Oh, it looks like it right here. Jeez, I knew it. Golly, I knew it was one of those you had to crawl in. I didn't see that at all until heckin' whatever this episode is. Oh, there's an alien alloy. It's just out in the open, but I have to avoid the lava, it looks like here. And lava is done. Okay, let's go and then quadruple jump. Is there anything else? No, that was it. You just had to come into here and get him. Boom, we got them all. Mission complete metallurgist. Awesome. Man, fine egg and Lee. Is Eco gonna say anything about that, Echo? 
Is she going to ever tell me how the heck can pronounce her name, though? I don't think so. I think that's it, so. Uh, yeah, we don't have anything else inside here, so. Right, look at this. Look at the. Oh, yeah, now we could craft the last thing, so that's good, but. Uh, oh, yeah, and by the way, point of interest. I guess there's still two things I missed out on. I don't know where that would be, but. Still, like, it was a six flora. I didn't. What the heck, big old nut. Okay. <laughs> Still stuff down here I didn't get, apparently. Alien tag, there's still one here. What? Where? I don't know. Uh, but hey, at least I got all the heckin'. Let's go to the journal. Yeah, we don't have anything else. We need to do round trip. I guess, do we just go back to Earth or or what? Yeah, survey the planet. That's all of that stuff. There. We're at 91%. Alien cinema. Oh, there's still, yeah. Itching fields. There's still one more alien and uh, alien a tablet. Still one there. And then within the spire, there's two more. So that's, that's going to be within the meatball guy, right? Yeah, two more inside the elevator realm, too. Golly. Lost and found two inside the spire, explorer logs inside there, so. And then one more in the elevator realm, too, so. Man, there's a lot of story we need to catch up on there, you guys, so. I don't know, maybe I'll just have episodes of me just literally just cutting to where I find them instead of showing you guys the actual exploration of it, because, golly, you guys gotten a ton of that these last one or two episodes, three episodes, or whatever this has been, right? So there you go. And now we're out here, so uh, I suppose we'll just go back to the heckin' teleport, go back to the javelin, uh, probably end things off right here. I don't know if it's going to be the end of the episode, or if it's going to be in the middle of an episode, or what, but uh, let's just go back to the javelin, get that last upgrade crafted, and I guess that'll be it for all the heckin' alien alloy, orange goo, and all that in the main quest and whatnot, right? So that's pretty cool. Let's just get the last upgrade, which is the fuel detector, which I don't even need, so bleep, there you go. And we got an achievement for the $600 man, okay, that's cool. Awesome. So yeah, look at that, we got every upgrade now. We got all the general, well, general doesn't even tell me anything except for stamina, 30 seconds, 200 health, and then weapon 14 out 14, 9 out 9, 6, 6, 9, 9, and then 6, 6. Yeah, we got everything now, you guys, it's crazy good. And I guess I'll just end the recording off right here. Like I said, I don't know if it's in the middle of an episode or at the end of an episode or what, but uh, we'll figure it out here in the next couple seconds <laughs> after I edit all this together. <laughs> Alright guys, yep, this is Waffle from the future that just got done editing that like 46 minute episode so far, and uh, yeah, we're at the end of the episode. I don't know how I was able to cut down like literally an hour and a half worth of footage down to like half, but it was crazy, so anyways, you guys know the deal by now. Thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below, and if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And when you're down there, be sure to ring that bell so YouTube sends you a notification as soon as the next episode of Journey to the Savage Planet comes out because we still got much more to do. And speaking of upcoming videos and whatnot, next episode, I'm definitely going to have to watch all of those like, videos and like the like, messenger log or whatever that we just picked up as well as that like enigmatic tablet and clip. Uh, maybe we'll put some of these puzzle pieces together, figure out what happens. Uh, even though we literally already beat the game and everything, at least we'll be able to finish up all that as well. As there's still a bunch over here that I haven't done yet in terms of, uh, yeah, Survey the Planet. I had 9% there, it's not too bad. And then uh, five more alien tablets I need to get, and three more explore logs I need to get, as well as that hot garbage DLC, which I still don't even own, so after I get done recording this, I'm probably going to go buy it. So, anyways, until then, thank you guys all very much for watching, and I'll see you guys here next time. Hold on, yeah, let me go outside. I need to go outside so I can wave. Thank you guys all very much for watching, and I'll see you guys here next time with some more Journey to the Savage Planet. Oh, bye there.